good afternoon, good afternoon, everybody. Hello. Hello, beautiful people. Yeah, sorry, I'm the moon. Hello, Claire. How are you? Miss you. Yeah, sorry, I'm the moon. Γεια σου Μάτα Hello beautiful people Hello Prima and Finata lovers Here again it's Vasilis from Athens From my studio I hope you can see me and you can hear me I found again a small drawers to make over today. I have this to put in my personal uh, things. I hope you can see. Ces Agnieszka. Hello, Sarah. Oh, 34 people already. Wow. I promise you, every week I have uh, something small, uh, a small uh, item, wooden item to make over. So I have this, I bought this in Hungary when I was, and uh, it's very useful because you put, uh, you can put the keys, you can put uh, everything, your fields, and uh, of course it's something that you can uh, make it. Uh, hello, Apri. You can make it uh, for a gift, for a friend, for your daughter, your granddaughter, uh, everybody. So I, I was thinking of what to do. Hi, Rose. Happy New Year, Rose. So happy. Hello, Maria. People from UK, Portugal, USA. I'm so happy to see you. From Greece. <coughs> so many friends. So, finally in Greece, we, get, we have cold. Zero degrees. Winter is coming, finally. Because till now we had a good weather, and uh, I repeat for the people that watch the first time, my name is Vasilis Kontos. I'm an artist from Greece, and I'm brand ambassador to Finaber uh, brand. Uh, and uh, I'm so happy that I make uh, some lives every month for a, a Prima marketing. Uh, one brand of my favorite to use with uh, amazing materials. So, I had this drawer and I, I, I was thinking how to make it. And uh, I decided to make it like uh, the blackboard effect. So, let's start. First, uh, I'm going to use black gesso from Finabel. Today I have the camera in the right position so you can see the letters properly and not uh, upside down. It depends how you put your phone. If you put across or on you, everything is uh, opposite. If you put it uh, in this way, you can see 
uh, he can uh, read the properly. So, from art basics, Teddy Gesso from uh, yes, yes, Katerina uh, from Pinaber, and what I'm going to do. So I hope uh, uh, the problem with the COVID finishes quickly and uh, everybody that uh, we are now in the internet, we can meet in live and as I just told me before that we speak together. Ah, when you apply the gesso, you can spray with water and this helps the gesso if you don't have black gesso, you can use uh, the impasto, for example, this uh, series of uh, finabel. Uh, it's acrylic colors, okay? But the black gesso is one of your uh, most important elements to have on products, because we make a lot of techniques with the black gesso, it's very useful, always. Okay, Play just a little more. Okay, because this kind of wood, and you can see, I apply properly with my brush because I want to have a, a smooth. But okay, I repeat. I'm not going to paint all my drawers with uh, black gesso. I'm going to paint on the top and left and right. On the back, uh, I can do after. It's not necessary to lose time now. Okay. And again, I love so much this page from Prima. Yasho Lenaki. Yes, black and white Yasho are the must of the must. Vediamo Lizza Tori. Miss you all from my classes. But the next Sunday meeting. And again, I pass with my glass. Okay, so I have the three. One, two, three, and of course, you can also on that here paint. You the black gesso. Black gesso is a water based uh, material from Finnabel. Uh, what else? What else information to give you? Uh, it's very thick. After you can uh, do everything you want nicely. Okay. Okay, but do you know something? I, I changed my mind. And uh, I paint also my brow in front because I'm going to make Sabino, so I need a black uh, base, a dark base. Okay. I was thinking all the afternoon what to do, what to do, what to do, and this brow I have a lot of time next to me in my studio and I look at uh, 
Kita masih di Jepang. Kita ini. And you know this kind of small uh, object that uh, everybody has in your house. And uh, of course, one bigger like this, but in this style, in this form, you can find in IKEA. You'll be at work again in Inesca. Hi, Mary. My good friend Mary from New York. Okay, <clears throat> we let it dry, and I'm going to tell you, ah, you make the panel, so I'm going to take you, to tell you one experience I had. So, in December, I bought, hello Shamela, I bought from Prima $350 a product. It's about uh, uh, 316 euro. I buy amazing things like this. Look, this amazing tissue paper. Look, look the beauty to put in the furniture on the side or uh, in your bedroom. Uh, I love it, love it. Look how beautiful and the colors and the designs and the, and the material is very beautiful. You can uh, make over uh, uh, something in your home uh, to, to be beautiful indeed. So I pay 350 dollars, about 316 euro, and imagine when they arrived to Greece, I had to pay in the custom 225 euro to take the product, right to one order uh, again, so much money. Next time, Mary, uh, I say to Prima to send you in, in, in New York, and I tell you send you by post. Okay, dry my flower. Okay. Now I want to make uh, the to look like blackboard, like the school. Here I can see there is just a little need more. Not with my brush and uh, dry quickly. Yes, uh, if you buy from USA and they arrive to Greece because it's not European community, you pay such a lot of money. Next time I buy, I say to Prima to send it to me in New York. 
Visita Kenny, Mary. Can you do that for me? Okay. So what I'm going to do? So I I love to look like uh, uh, <clears throat> like blackboard. So I'm going to use the the white impasto from Art Alchemy. It's this color. What is this? It's a, an acrylic color based in water and uh, very thick. Uh, it's uh, what other information? You can paint uh, directly, you can paint uh, and spray with water, you can use impasto, uh, make stencil, if you mix. Uh, Caterina, I go to Bao. Caterina, I go to Bao, I keep in touch with Scorbo, I go to the Corona Air, I keep in touch with his own mother, but I don't think it's a good thing to do with the Corona Air. So, in pasta, Snow White, it's the white color. Okay. So I will add white in pasta. And I'm going to use the classic brass from Corbe Stretzi. A brass like this, a hard brass. Okay, and I'm going to use this beautiful glue. Okay, and what I'm going to do, I take with my brush, okay, leave it in my clay, I don't want a lot of color in my brush, and I'm going to paint in this way. Or you can do like this. I don't want the stencil be so much visible. How to say? Uh, you are going to see the result when I finish. So in some point, I put a lot, and in some place less. Okay. But the important is not to have a lot of color in your brush to have this result. So let's see. Here needs a, a little more. Always we check before you remove your stones. Huh? Okay. And this is the result. This is what I wanted to look like something in a blackboard. Okay. And I'm going to repeat the same to the other side. So I'm using this to put my stencil again.
I like this style because it's minimal and uh, always looks beautiful. Don't forget, uh, hi Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Elizabeth Sunday we have a workshop. Don't forget. Ariadne, to jest to też ten sił. I voila, as the friend saying, So I let it a, a, a little dry and maybe because it, it's like blackboard I add some letters from the Finaber collection you know between here, switch off here I, I think it will be, be uh, more beautiful Now in the front you see, on both sides. Okay, let it dry, and we are going to paint now in front. Okay, uh, we keep this because we are going to use it again. And now, I decided to have uh, two colors for my drawers. Okay. Uh, the wild iris and the dusty rose because it's, the tones are uh, similar uh, uh, in my first thought was to have three different colors here but i think it's too much so i believe that uh, two colors will be perfect so i begin with the wild iris Again, uh, the color is in pasta again from Art Alchemy. It's a uh, thick acrylic paint, water base. Okay, and the second color I'm going to use, it's, you know, I love so much this color, Dusty Rose. It's a uh, so beautiful color. Okay, and uh, I take another soft brush. I, I'm working always with soft brows. So, I take just a little color with my brush, okay? And I'm going to paint Okay, this I paint purple or this uh, the iris. As you can see, I leave some points with uh, to reflect the black because uh, this make it more shabby, more vintage. Okay, I like it like this. Uh, the good with the impasto colors that uh, are very strong and thicker. It's uh, if you make it also like this, you can apply and make uh, shades and uh, more, uh, a vintage style. Okay, so let's paint and the first. So
So the first and the second, and the, and the third, the last one with the irons. And in, in the middle, I'm going to paint with uh, the, the, the dusty rose. You see just a little color in my brush. And I paint cross and cross and cross. And in some points, I cover the black. Some points, I leave it. And I have a very beautiful and shabby look. Okay. And now I'm going to paint uh, in the middle with the dusty rose. Take care of my brush not to. Okay, dusty rose here. With the same way. Oh, take it a little off. Okay. Keep it like this because I, do, I don't want to paint it in you know, this part. I want to stay black. So, three beautiful colors. Lulu, where are you, Lulu? Miss you, Lulu. How's your kids? How's your son? I can see the photos and I can see your boy, it's better. And I'm so happy, you know. I know, I know, you know, it's like the analysis that I made, it's a uh, hard therapy for the person that needs them after, but uh, you must be positive that your boy will be fine and everything will be okay again. And you remember that like a battle dream. Okay, now let's, let's, I, I want to take uh, the pencil from Finaber. I love so much all this pencil. 
but the world is my favorite one. No, 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 no. No. Wait one minute, please. Found it, found it. Okay. So let's make a story in uh, our uh, drawer. Okay, so the story will begin here we have the number. I like to This stencil, yes, it's uh, the new one from the last year. Uh, so I'm going to use icing paste, two colors. The white gold. And the rose gold. The rose gold is an amazing color. You see, it's a, it's a based water paste, especially for stencil, are very thick and uh, it's like a creamy and... Uh, yes, Katerina, uh, and the colors are very nice, very, you see, you can see the rose, the gold, and here you can see the white, the gold, and a little silver, it's, it's, uh, as, you, as you see, in every, if you turn it, you change the colors. I like it very much. So, let's start. Uh, on the palette now, or as you say in the spatula. In the spatula. On my right, it's better to, to use. And I start. So. Here I have a dark, uh, so I need uh, more gold, uh, so my story, let's start from here, and I mix the rose gold, both, and the gold, and the result is very, 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 very beautiful. Okay, so I don't want uh, all, I, I want the part. See a stock indigo, indigo from Bentart, from Hungary. I, uh, I heard that uh, you go back uh, to work uh, and you are all safe in the go. And I'm happy, except Kathy and George. But I hope soon they come back. Uh, they come back to work. Okay, so here I want the numbers, the, the, the two numbers. I can see from the drawer. Okay, this. 
this is the most important and uh, now my story will end here Again, I mix the two colors. The okay. This is what I wanted. Okay, so I clean here. And here, okay. But I want also. I'm going to make a damage, I know, I'm sure, because I want it to begin from here. So let's just, just to see if I can add a little. Yes, I did it, okay, super. Okay, so let's dry quickly and make some decoration. You like it, Samella? Thank you. Hello, Joanna. Says Joanna. Mister, what these are called? What? Claire, you mean uh, the paste? It's a stencil paste, it's a, a icing paste. The name is icing paste. They are water-based, and the first is white gold, and the other is rose gold. Is it okay, Claire? Oro blanco, oro rosado. I can tell you also in French, or rose or blanc. I don't know in, in, in what other language. <laughs> okay. So, let's dry. I put our cabinet like this, you can see better. I see paste, yes, there is another color, clear. But I'm using this too for my drawer. I'm so happy with this slide because you can show 
to the people that uh, the Finnabel products are not only for the mixed media or the steampunk, uh, as uh, she, she became famous all this year, but we can use it also to make home decor, to make furniture, to make uh, a lot of other uh, uh, objects or objects we have in home and uh, make over and transform and uh, the materials, all these materials work perfectly and are very good quality. So I, I just want to inform you about this. Uh, my stencil dry and now I was thinking in the uh, in the drawer make uh, some uh, decoration for example I can add uh, some stars one big uh, one smaller like this okay uh, we can make the opposite down here, one I can add one big, and as we can see, I'm going to add in the empty space. So I, I make uh, I'm using this uh, uh, mouse from Primaver. All this, uh, these are the Primaver mouse. And I'm using a resin uh, to make some shapes. Uh, if the draw is for a girl, it will be nice. The lady here, maybe with the wings. And you can make a beautiful uh, here and the lady here. And you can add some uh, uh, cocks and some uh, one more star for here and I have of course with me no this will be here okay and I, I have of course with me what else I can use one smaller star to make uh, Here and a bigger cock so the lady can sit uh, here properly. You can add here. You know, I try now to make uh, some. Uh, And one smaller here. It's beautiful. I will add also one. Maybe here. No, here it's okay. Also, you can put some flowers. You can use the moon. So this resin, it's, a, it's an elastic resin. You can find it in the market from a lot of brands uh, and uh, dry very quickly in 15 minutes. And you can use all you know, the Mouth of Prima and Funabel and uh, generally you can cut from the view. Ah, also if uh, this uh, this kind of uh, resin, if you use uh, uh, your embossing gun becomes just a little more elastic okay. 
Let's see. If we can put here the moon and the smaller. Okay, so let's use the heavy body tail. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Where are these heavy body tail? The most useful paste from Finabe. Heavy body tail. New one just arrived from USA. You see how we we'll transform the this drawer, small drawer, quickly with something more uh, interesting. I don't care now if the modeling go out. The modeling, so the the heavy body gel go out. I'm going to remove after with a, a brush. Okay. So I put the box so the lady can see it. I need to put it just a little more for the body tail here and I put the lady here and okay now do the star the small star I, I will like it here because I want to have three and three And again, I will like to put like this, like this, like this, like this. No. 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 I don't like it's too much. But I can add it here. To cover the empty space. Okay. We need uh, to the other side. We need the. Uh, I like this one. Okay. 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 So clean my hand from the table of the gel. And now with the small brush, remove the extra, the extra heavy body. And just a quickly, I'm going to make a quickly check to my uh,
You see how beautiful. Do you like how you make it to feel now? And we move here. For this time you must have small fingers. Like a lady fingers, like Anna has. And you can put the, the heavy body better. And uh, uh, keep on So the heavy body gel, it's a product from Finaver. It's a water-based paste. Okay, it's from Art Basics, and uh, it's a, a gel that you can use uh, as a paste to extension, but uh, you can use also uh, with. Uh, it's a stronger glue. Sorry. Sometimes in the life you are a little stressed and you forgot what you want to say. Okay? So, these are okay. And very quickly, just to check if uh, I can add something more from my present box of my Finabel. Uh, I think no. Okay, so this not big flowers, no stars or house. Uh, I have the star, it's too big. The sun, the coats. Oh. You can add something like this, perfection is overrated, uh, or um, whatever you are, the good one. Okay. You can uh, add a label like this, or lucky. You are like no. okay, okay. You can do that. Some ideas now. And let's see the second uh, treasure box. I know that you want this treasure box, and I have one big box with a item inside a basement. I believe you, if you show, you want all. No. No. Yes, you can add the. A butterfly. If you like the butterflies, you can add here a butterfly. Okay. So, dear friends, now so let's see on the top if it's everything okay. If uh, the wings, the, the lady needs just a little more there. This is okay. Yes, now I can. Because if you sit, you cannot check. You must get up to, do, to check. So, uh, Now what can uh, I can add? Yes. So I can add some glass to the body, like this, on the top of this. Okay.
and the next thing here I have you can put some also for decoration some numbers okay good so I have another you can put some here I have another or No, it's okay. It's okay. They move uh, so I can uh, explain you because you don't have a lot of time. So, yes, we will be coming from here. So, they must dry and uh, not move now. Move. Uh, I can, uh, I can paint the. Uh, the my embellishment with white gesso but I have here the white impasto that it's also strong like the gesso so I can paint them with uh, with white gesso or uh, sorry with white impasto on my embellishment and then I give colors and uh, carefully I'm not careful now because uh, we don't have time. But uh, I'm going to show you the, pro the process. So I paint everything with the white impasto first, and after I'm going to use liquid colors and uh, the end of the boxes to give a beautiful. Finish. Okay. Now I'm carrying it. 
No. Doesn't matter, I can paint after the day around or make sage with my, my matte boxes. So um, it's not a problem if you paint around. You can make sage with your matte boxes and you have a beautiful result. Don't worry. Uh, so, quickly I'm going to paint everything. Even the nail. I could paint directly, but uh, I like uh, to paint with white gesso. So the next material sit uh, properly and uh, give her the color that I want. And uh, because this resin, it's creamy, it's this creamy color that maybe you change your uh, a little uh, the colors and don't have a nice uh, result. Oh, it's more a lot. Need more dry. Okay, need more dry. So, uh, uh, in the past live, I made two cabinets that I didn't finish to get because I had uh, some other things to finish. Uh, I didn't forget. Uh, soon, tomorrow, tomorrow I believe I finished the, the cabinet I made last week and post the photos. And soon, uh, the first cabinet that I made in December, if you remember, the big one, this needs a little go of work you see it's moving everybody so soon we are going to see the result uh, of these two cabinets post the photo and uh, show you i didn't forget but i had to finish the project for the sunday 24 uh, January that will be our first workshop and see us talk to Catalina. See us talk is hello in Hungary. Hungary is my second country because I love so much the Hungarian people and the people of Hungary loves me and we have a very good uh, show. So I paint everything with uh, the white in pastel. We'll dry now and after. I'm going to work with the burning scanner and the new color uh, liquid acrylic to give the same that I want. I'm going to show you which color I'm going to use. So I'm going to use the violet because I have this color in my uh, in my cabinet, I'm going to use the bell schema, of course, uh, we use a lot of bell schema, maybe uh, I'm going to use the, the nude, this is the bell schema and black, and black, 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 ink black, so, I continue with these uh, four colors. Uh, when my embellishment dry and uh, doesn't move because now they are moving and cannot uh, do that. Uh, so I am going to paint uh, with uh, the liquid acrylics and after I'm going to finish with the matte boxes. The, 
the mud rocks block in the mud rocks uh, maybe the rose gold the new one will suit me definitely in, uh, in this color and I post again to you can see the result of this uh, tool and uh, because I want uh, in some parts uh, my flower get rusty I'm going to use the metallic color with the name uh, hazelnut this color just here in the corners to make it look more old okay so the four little that rings plus this one plus the mud waxes and we are going to see the result soon so just to say a good night oh, to move the camera oh. hi everybody so this is my small drawer for today let's see if uh, you can see me So our uh, next appointment is uh, at uh, 28 and I find something again uh, uh, important to show you, uh, maybe something small like this, uh, okay. I hope you like it, the result. Thank you very much everybody, thank you Prima, thank you Finabel, thank you all of you that support me and uh, watching me. Uh, Ariadne, I make something like this to send you for a gift, do you? Στις 28 τα κερίνα την ίδια ώρα. At 28, the same hour, don't forget. Uh, 28, it's uh, my last for January with uh, the design uh, live and uh, 24 without our first uh, uh, class. I hope to see you there this Sunday. We are going to speak about the resins, about mounts, uh, how to do it quickly what products you can use okay uh, will be uh, interesting again our class I promise you because in every class I going to show you something important okay so the ladies okay so Άρα, χαίρομαι που σας αρέσει αδειάδειο, θα σου στείλω ένα ίδιο. So, uh, wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. So, 28 for your jewelry. I keep it upside down, sorry. This one. I hope you like it, this one. We can make this one with uh, paper and uh, uh, maybe in Baroque style. So this is something this uh, gave me for a gift uh, in Hungary, a lady that comes from Serbia, one of my classes, and I keep it uh, to 
who made it on day, so the day is coming. So 28th of uh, January, we are going to make over this uh, furniture, this small uh, cabinet, okay? So, good night, bye-bye, stay safe. Uh, Baroque style with you know, the papers, of course, my style. So, good night, everybody. Good night, uh, Prima lovers and Finaver lovers. See you in the 28th. Don't forget. Thank <laughs> you.